Cool. So hey guys, I have an awesome video today. As we drive through this golf course area, because that's why I thought it wasn't into a graveyard. So no, the, the video I want to talk about today, which is awesome, is my motorcycle seat. So I had recently had issues and I've complained about my seat being stiff as a board. Planking, it's really big on the internet. What you do, make your body stiff as a board, see? Oh, no! And just unfucking comfortable, man. Just so uncomfortable. So I had I had looked around and custom making a seat for me. And I thought to myself, well shit. What can I do to make it better? What can I do to make this seat better? So I looked up some gel pads. I looked, it was like $90 and you had to install it yourself. Didn't look too hard. I thought, that's a great idea. That would work well. And then I found out there was a company called A Great Day to Ride. It was just, you know, forum browsing and things like that. And I found this guy and people were like, yeah, go to Spencer's Motorcycles and get it done, man. He's the best. The seats are so comfortable. I'm like, who the hell is this guy? I gotta look it up, and this guy's like, "Oh yeah, he only cost it. He only cost me like a hundred bucks to ship it there and back, and all the work." And I was like, "Oh wow, I gotta try this. I gotta, I gotta look in this guy." So I reached out to him, thinking, "Oh, we'll see what this guy knows." This guy knew exactly what my seat was like, how it rides, everything down to the friggin' letter. This was amazing. I was like, "Holy crap, this guy knows his shit," and I was really happy. So I was like, oh man, this is awesome. This guy knows his stuff. This is great. So we emailed back and forth and he's like, you know, it's not gonna be a good, you know, like long distance ride or anything, but it's gonna be significantly more comfortable. And I was like, sweet. Well, hell yeah, let's do this. So I sent out my seat to him and it took him like, between all the shipping there and back, it took about a week, which was awesome. I was not expecting such a quick turnaround. Super fast, dude, like getting this stuff done. And the moment I got my seat in, oh my God. It feels a little different. I sit just a tiny bit lower, but I'm more center. And my butt doesn't hurt as much anymore. I feel so much more comfortable. And that to me is, oh, and it's cheaper. It's way cheaper than buying an Airhawk. It's way cheaper than doing it yourself with a gel pad that might or may not work. This is amazing. And he's using a technology uh, called SupraCore. Like, if you guys know what the purple mattress is, it's kind of like that. But just just Google SupraCore. And it's spelled the same way like a Toyota Supra. But just give it a look and look at his place. His website is called A Great Day to Ride. So I just want to tell you guys about him. Spencer is fucking awesome this guy is just an awesome dude and he's one of those guys that you would love to just sit and have a beer with unfortunately he is a little bit too busy for that and he does say that in his faqs but he's just awesome to hang just to talk to like in terms of his knowledge it's just it's unparalleled uh, but he knew even about my bike which is very niche this bike is super duper duper niche and he knew about it and that to me is amazing you don't get that a lot amongst people you're like, oh, what's a CB1000R? Or like, oh yeah, it's a CB1000R. That's the Italian thing, right? It's You don't get someone who knows automatically what's wrong with it, with the seat, and how to fix it. That just made me so happy. And very, very good business. A very, just very, very nice customer support. Cus or not customer support, customer service. And I can't thank him enough. Spencer, you made this motorcycle seat so much more enjoyable. I've been now riding for a good hour, hour and a half, and my booty don't hurt at all. It feels great. It, do, it, it, it it's a little, it's a little flat, but it feels a lot better than the hard ass seat I had to deal with before. And I'm so thankful, dude. I can't thank you enough for this. You are quintessential hero right now to me because I can now ride longer distances. I can go and visit friends who are an hour and a half away on my motorcycle and not have to think, God, just I'm just gonna drive it because my ass is gonna kill me. This is so much better, Spencer. You are a hero. Thank you so much. My back doesn't hurt either. Like I would used to crack my back a lot and go, oh, my back. I don't have that anymore. It's like, it's fixed all that. So I'm so, so happy. 
I can't, I, I seriously, I can't thank you enough, Benny. You're awesome. I, I would hope one day, you know, we are going to Florida come March, and I hope if this, uh, I hope you see this video, and I would love just to stop by and say hi. I'm not gonna, it made me do like a quick filming of your shop, man, and do like a commercial for you, completely free, just because you're that fucking awesome. I, I want to give back to you for giving this to me. Yeah, I know I bought it. Yeah, no, it's just that's how much I really like this modification. So thank you so much, man. And, and if not, you know, I just want to stop by, say hi. You know, just hey, thanks. Get a get a picture with you or something, because that's how awesome you are, man. I recommend if you guys are having issues of your seat or like it's just not that comfortable, reach out to Spencer. He's amazing. He's really nice and he'll help you out. He helped me out, and I can't thank him enough. He took a bike that's really not meant for long-distance riding, male long-distance riding. And here's the coolest part about it, too. I got itchy eye. The coolest part is that I don't lose any type of control with the bike. At all. I am super glued to this seat when I go through turns. I feel way more confident in turns now than I ever did. And the seat doesn't really wobble a lot or squish a lot it's just kind of there it's so much more nicer it, uh, more nicer it's just so much nicer so I'm really happy I love it I absolutely love it we're on the highway right now we shouldn't be on the highway but I took the wrong turn do a downtown ride motherfuckers yeah but so that's I mean that's pretty much my review I can't thank you enough Spencer I know I said like 20 times already, but seriously, I give him, I give him a 10 bricks out of 10. So it, like, just, I, 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 if I were to do reviews on things, I'm going to say it right now. 10 bricks out of 10. <laughs> just worth every, every penny. Super affordable too. Uh, I mean, people look at Airhawks and they're so expensive and they fuck around on the seat with you and you don't want it to. And this is cheap, affordable, and perfect in every way. And the quality is... I mean, my seat looks stock. You would never know I modified my seat. Ever. It looks completely bone stock. So, yeah. It's definitely a humongous improvement over the original. Like, bar none. And I, I can't wait to see if he comes up with more stuff in the future, too. Uh, he does passenger seats, too. So if you have a person on the passenger seat, you can also get them, you know, set up with his with his stuff so yeah definitely go check out his site again it's a great day to ride.com or dot net i'll put it up here i'll put it up excuse me i'll put it up here in the video and i'll put a link in the description below as well and link it so if you click on it it'll open a new tab and go straight to them definitely worth it I had such a such i had such a great experience with this and, and and coming to the city here this is where it's going to really get a workout because i'm going to be stop and go traffic sitting whatnot today is just so beautiful you don't get this often here like in the middle of fucking february it's time it's beginning of february and it's 60 degrees out it's nice enough where i can wear i can wear these gloves and my hands aren't even that cold they're not even cold actually they're not even that cold they're not cold at all yeah, let's take you guys around Columbus. I promised I'd take you guys around Columbus, and here we are. Hopefully I have battery life enough for this time. <laughs> there we go. That kind of protects me from the wind just a bit. Ow. I, I raised myself in the seat on that one because I knew it was going to hurt. I'm glad I did because it still kind of hurt. Ow, my nuts. Yeah, welcome to downtown, folks. Most dangerous place to drive on a motorcycle because people don't pay the fuck attention. We're just going to cut straight through. We went from one end of Columbus, now we're going through the other. So this is fine. Speed limit's 35 here. I don't know why I'm going slow. Wow, they cleared that fucker out. That was the park. That was the grassy park that they had for, um... Just for the, the not concerts and stuff, but the other stuff. Like the, uh... Food truck festival and shit. It's gone. Huh. It was like... That's the shortest way through Columbus. There's another, like, if you take the longer way, it's a little bit more, um, what's the word? It's a little bit bigger, but... And we're back on the highway. Yay, a little quick little tourist to Columbus, huh?
Hey guys, thank you for watching. I want to thank my subscribers so very much for tuning in. If you like what you see, subscribe to the channel. We post every Tuesday and Thursday. You butthole! Look what he's doing right now!